Roll left. Roll left. So we're doing the uh, ghillie weathering exercise. We were ensuring that their ghillie suits get the, the right color, which is this Georgia clay color. We're teaching them how to basically be resistant to all kinds of environmentals. You'll do some, uh, some exercises here going up the hill. We'll do our famous sniper push-up. One shot! Go! One kill! Basically a long push-up with everybody's hands on the ground, your feet on your shoulders, all the way down like a snake. They'll run over about 200 meters, 300 meters that way to our top ghillie wash lane up there. Right. Crawl through, get the mud on their, on their shoulders, on their back, and then they'll do some series of exercises. Buddy carries going down this way, all the way down to our deeper trench. We're teaching them how to basically be resistant to all kinds of environmental. They gotta be able to withstand, you know, cold water, dirty conditions, and that's where a sniper should thrive. So that's the difference between being a sniper and a marksman. You gotta be willing to go out there and hide in the mud, hide in the swamps, and you know, get that opportunity for that one shot. Two, three. The important of the ghillie wash is to get your ghillie suits to be coated in that earthy color. So like if you ghillie washed up in Colorado, it'll be more of that light tan. And then here in Georgia, it's that, that red brown, that clay. It's mainly just about the culture and the, um, you know, the teamwork and the rite of passage that comes with it. Attention! Your mission is to subscribe and beat feet to the next video. Why haven't you done it yet?